Meet, us, meet, meet me at the park at three, or the bike racks at three. Or 303, however long it takes you to get there. Don't be late. No. I don't know why you gotta set a meeting or an appointment. Sounds like an insurance claim. <laughs> okay, now. A better idea would be, for example, crafts. Now, if you're into crafts, like, Like kites. <laughs> you might meet someone building a kite because <laughs> like there's ideal places to go and fly kites, okay? So if you meet someone flying a kite, right? <laughs> and it happens to be a woman <laughs> of the same age. Maybe goes to your school because you're maybe at the school field. <laughs> Places children fly kites. This is not like a romantic strategy, okay? This is literally just interacting with someone who's doing the same activity as you and then enjoying <laughs> enjoying that. Now, someone doing that, or someone seeing that, and then you, then using that as a romantic gesture to attract someone or lure someone in with an activity that they enjoy is not <laughs> see you don't get get a girl like you just live you're, you're you do things and and there's other people doing things and you do things with people <laughs> it, just, it happens <laughs> you have to be there <laughs> now No, you can't get rid of kites because now you're saying like, like for example, Charlie Brown is getting all the girls because <laughs> he has a dog and kite. No, he has, he, he's going outside. He's done a lot of things. Now he's building a kite because it's probably where he's at with scouts or something, or he's just maybe as a sister. I don't know. <laughs> just, maybe you, you just are interested in kites because they're kind of cool. <laughs> Yeah, kind of cool. Like, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> but if you couldn't... <laughs> no. <laughs> Maybe that wasn't Charlie Brown's dog. Maybe that dog... Or... Is he even a dog? <laughs> Maybe it's just there, because, like... He sent one to the moon. <laughs> but no. But maybe it's just there, because, like... It's just people at the same place. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He's people. But kind of consider people there. Maybe it's Caillou flying a I don't, I don't remember the truck. Yeah, so this is the thing, right? <laughs> now, setting up a system where you're like, yeah, if, I, if you use this poem, it's gonna work, man. Give her this kite, man. I swear it's gonna work. <laughs> like, you know, that. <laughs> That's a plot. That's an agenda. <laughs> I don't know if, like... <laughs> no. <laughs> That's not a game. <laughs> no. Let's say Charlie Brown is like, okay, <laughs> this kite thing is getting a little out of control. Kites are my thing, it's not this kite, I'm not gonna fight someone over kites, like... 
Like, it's a peaceful activity. It doesn't require, there's no fighting in kites. Like, you'll rip it. It's, like, it's a kite. It contradicts the experience of a kite. <laughs> now, if, let's say you go, here, let's go Charlie, let's Charlie Brown. Let's say he's like, let me go kick the ball around. <laughs> now you see him kicking the ball around too. Now you find other people are kind of saying the same thing. <laughs> and here we are again. <laughs> it's a lot later. Debo doesn't really need the bike. <laughs> and he doesn't even... <laughs> like, I... <laughs> like I said, <laughs> Big Worm takes all worm. So... This is the thing, now, if, if, if a person starts using kites again, in the same spirit, why, of, you know, why he originally used kites, or she. That's not like re-sparking an argument with a person, because a person's still trying to get an insurance claim off of being like, let's say, an expert kite builder. They're like, oh, well, he's the kite builder. So if I X the kite builder out or take out the kite builder, I could use all his insurance and transfer it into something else I like doing. <laughs> like, so now, if that child now is like older and they, or it's later on and they go, you know, fly that same kite again, and all of a sudden they say it's illegal to fly the kite because <laughs> someone's made an entire life out of. <laughs> <laughs> like a fake story about kites or something or poetry or I don't know like a girl or something like that to get a green card for I don't even know man like they'd be on some other stuff realistically at the end of the day <laughs> at the end of all of this if the person still likes flying kites, he's still gonna go fly the kite. <laughs> That's not a metaphor for some for something. I'm, I'm talking about the flying a kite because we're talking about crafts, right? Now, if the person, let's say, was like they did the kite as well to let's say get the person who was at the same location, and the other person doesn't even know because they just are now in a different location flying kites because kites take you places. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. You take kites places. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now. This is the thing, right? If, let's say people start calling out that person, and let's say he was inauthentic or insincere or whatever, and now he starts doing poetry, and now he's not really, like, that into it anymore. <laughs> because his only motivation was, it was an insincere, it was, not, it was not a genuine motivation. He might be, he might have gained talents or gained skills, actually, more so, doing that, but the other person might not even know <laughs> Had an argument, or that dude set up a fake argument to get something that he shouldn't have had. And then the other dude just took a really long break from kites, and then he did a lot of other stuff. And then now that he's back to flying kites, he's like a trillion times better. <laughs> so for him, it's just as simple as it was at the beginning. And not even simple, uncomplicated as it was in the beginning. <laughs> no. This is all to say that if you go and do something like fly a kite, <laughs> you'll get something from it. And what I mean by that is if you go do things you enjoy doing, you'll get something from it. And don't all lives matter this or LGBTQ community this shit. <laughs> or y'all, no. Be like, oh, it's talking about... <laughs> no, I'm not talking about that, y'all shitheads. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stop changing children's pure emotions into weird sexual or sensual things. Like, it's... it's pedophilic and just it's not like it's it's like hunt it's like hunting fam it's like it's like hunting it's like it's like paraplegic hunting i don't even know how to word this no offense it's just that's really what it'd be like <laughs> now if you play 
an actor in a wheelchair and you're not in a wheelchair then you make fun of that wheel that type of thing after is that rude <laughs> i never did that i just it's just the other people who may say that what i said was insensitive when they've done insensitive things to people who are lacking actual sensitivity and i'm actually a person who's helped people heal those type of sensitivity issues but or help them restore it themselves but anyways just to let y'all know <laughs> um, but anyways so <laughs> it's all to say do what you enjoy doing not like life is short or something like that it's not short it's, life is life it's not short it doesn't have a length <laughs> okay <laughs> you know if you flew kites because you can put any amount of string to it and there's a, uh, <laughs> but the point is is simple experiences can take you a long way with time and if you don't have those experiences but the ones that you want to do not out of competition not out of somewhere making you suffer or having to suffer for something just <laughs> having everything you need and then doing that because you want to do it and not someone else wanting to do it <laughs> and then interacting with other people who are doing that <laughs> the point is, is <laughs> that's more so what a career is or what a craft is or what actually it is to have a <laughs> what like you know Uh, a healthy start to developing a relationship so the dynamics are natural <laughs> you don't have to be like re-signed and condition like like a contract or something <laughs> there's like a natural renewal to it <laughs> you get what i'm saying so This is all to say that <laughs> stop scaring the children so they can go outside and do things they enjoy. <laughs> even if they don't know about a lot of this stuff, people are just so open with the, not even speaking about it is one thing. We have stories, we know about a lot of this stuff, right? but people are people are just so open with doing weird stuff that people feel that. And I guarantee you, a butterfly would not fly past weirdos. Unless it was trying to cause, like, a hurricane inside a person's body or something. I don't know if that if butterflies can do that. But, I mean, inside another... Pro that's, like, the other side of the world, right? So. I don't know. I don't do poetry, though. I don't really do poetry. 